That's right. Oh my god, and I spawned next to a cave, and that's where I want to build. Welcome, or oh, welcome back to another video. Today, I had one goal in mind, and that was to build the coolest cave base in Rust. And I definitely think I achieved this. So without spoiling anything, sit back, relax, and I really hope you guys enjoy. You guys killed it with the support last video. I, I can't thank you all enough, it was insane. And uh, hopefully we're just getting started on this, this little YouTube journey we've got going on here. I'm super excited for the future. Yeah, I just want to thank you all. It's just, it's just insane. That's basically, that's basically it. Spawning right next to the cave meant I was there within minutes. Hopefully it would be uncontested and we could begin what was going to be an incredible solo wipe. Okay, let's get down into this cave because it's so close to fresh spawn I'm terrified that someone's going to take it. Oh, metal hatchet, no way. You already got 100 metal frags, what? OP. Yeah. Oh, oh, okay, 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 hold up. Oh, this is nice. And to my surprise, the cave was free. Wasting no time, I began constructing this underground stronghold. Yo! Yes! Awesome! Okay, we have this cave secure, I guess? I do need a TC and I have 50 wood. Okay, that is a successful trip. We've made it back with some resources. Oh, I feel rushed. I'm just scared. I'm a scared solo player living in a cave. So I think we could do a nice like up and over. Just keep going up and down and up and down. I think that's what I'll try to do. Can we still place that? Yeah, awesome. We'll have two squares here. So here we go. Here's the plan. The roof bunker. Potentially do like a drop box up here. I don't really know. We could place like a triangle. We'll wool this in. And we'll... So we'll go up and over. And then we'll wool this here again. Like this. Yeah, dude. This is... Yes. I, I kind of know what I'm doing, I think. This is going to be cool. I need to figure out where I want to put TC, though. I would like to get an oil refinery in here, too. I need to think about that. Um, I mean, I guess we could do something like this. Like, realistically, no one's going to raid from this this angle, right? Yeah, I think we have some sort of a footprint down. I'm happy about this. This is okay. Okay. We have the very basic footprint. The tool cupboard being placed now meant this cave was officially mine. It was now time to explore my area and begin progressing by gathering materials. There is so many nodes, but not much cloth, and obviously, I wouldn't mind some cloth. I want something to defend myself with. Ah! Uh, no! We get this piggy as well. Come here, boy! Little oinker. Awesome. And if you're wondering why I'm keeping the skulls, you'll uh, you'll soon find out. Yeah, dude, I love living in a cave, man. It's been it's been a while. I do enjoy it. So far, so good. There was no time to waste. I had to continue exploring around my area whilst trying to stay out of the way of potential enemies that could slow my progression. Got a little furnace running. Nice. Awesome. Ooh. <laughs> GG. <laughs> Can't even get through. Okay. We're chilling. Hey, look at that run. Crazy. And the reason that I've kept these 
skulls is because we can craft these skull spikes and they automatically light up at night which is so cool it's basically just a light that doesn't decay and automatically turns on so it's like a win it's just a win-win it's so cool man so when it turns to night time these will automatically turn on yeah automatic awesome amazing fabulous i think i want to upgrade this and this just so when people look through this gap they just see another wall they don't really see too much okay and then yeah i guess i just place the door here we have ourselves a little airlock. I guess for now I'll uh, I'll stairs this. Oh yeah, look, look they turn on. It's night time. Dude, this is so cool. Dude, this feels so spooky. It feels like I'm in a horror game. <laughs> I don't like it. And this is another good thing about these little skull spikes is I'll know exactly when it's morning because they'll extinguish. So these actually kind of pay to win, bro. Kind of, oh, there you go. Look, it's gone. This one will go in a second as well. Yep, there we go. <laughs> That's so cool. Yeah, you can't fit. Yeah, no way you can fit through there. And then we'll just do that. The first day of the server had passed and it was a very successful one. However, I never got any PVP. So that was what I set out to do. I can't really see this guy. I can't see him barely. What is going on? <laughs> I can barely see him. Oh my goodness. Base, 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 base now. We made it. We made it. Yes. That is an epic run. Oh, I'm already liking this. I'm already liking this, dude. Let's go. Time to upgrade. Crossbow time. And of course, nail gun. Now I had a tier one, I could craft the deadly crossbow and nail gun duo. This would give me a massive advantage against other players in my area. Samora. <laughs> I can't kill him. Ooh. I guess that's quite depot worthy. Home sweet home. Yeah, so what I was thinking with this is that these two raised foundations here and here could act as kind of like pea cups. So let's say I get raided through doors, I can come up here and, you know, defend and same here. I think it'll look quite cool. Ooh, I see a milk crate. Let me get that. Oh, SMG body, nice. I also haven't mentioned, but this wipe, I'm playing Blue Lagoon, so Fishing Village actually has a recycler, which is pretty cool. Definitely going to take advantage of that, I think. Hey, dude, this is the best purchase I've ever made on this game. <laughs>
And especially when I'm living in a cave, it just basically tells me that there's no point in going outside because it's pitch black. And then eventually we can ladder hatch here. So... I'll pull that off. Then I could also ladder hatch here. Hold up, this is going to be cool. Wait, I've got a good idea. So this could be our bedroom. We can have a kit, like a bed and some kits with a window to peek out of and we can ladder hatch it. And we just chuck another door here. Go like this. Okay, hold up, we're kind of getting somewhere. And then we'll snake garage doors, like one, two, three. And then here. I did this last video and you guys thought it was pretty cool. We could have like another form of defense, I guess, if we are to get raided. I like this. I like how this is going. This is really, really cool. Okay, yeah, this I see the vision. I see I see what I want to do here. This is cool, man. And then this obviously can just be like the open plan. Get some boxes here eventually. We'll move we'll figure out where we want to put this. I'm really hoping we can get an oil refinery here. I'm really hoping. But yeah, this is gonna be cool. Hopefully this gives me a hundred percent. Oh it does. Oh perfect. Perfect. There we go, a little bit more secure. Just place that there as well. I then decided to head to Junkyard, my closest monument in hopes of a green key card. Hold up, is it not looted? No way. Could I get a green card? Please. No. The diesel's respawned already. Unlimited diesel glitch. Ooh, hazmat. That is something I can get behind. Hey, give me that skull. <laughs> oh, three stone kits. You know what? That's not terrible. Oh, it's underground. <laughs> I just shit myself so much. <laughs> Hundred scrap from that little junkyard run. Really good. Obviously, the goal here is just to get a tier two workbench. Then we can beef the base up. It's going to be super cool. Put down windows, garage doors, make weapons, of course. Yeah, that's definitely the plan. And so far, so good, right? I don't actually think I've died. Should we try and stay alive for as long as possible? Oh, I want to... I can't. I have too much on me. I have too much on me. 315 scrap. You know what? We're not actually, like, terribly far away. I'm actually surprised. I think I just saw someone. I'm pretty sure I did. Yeah, I did, yeah. Oh, yes, sir. Awesome, man. Awesome. What is going on here? Okay. Sorry, bro. I mean... Oh my god, what? I didn't expect that guy to have anything. Oh, look at his eyes. Oh. There it is, yeah. <laughs> Dude, that was crazy. <laughs> Give me that skull. I'm the skull collector. I want them all. Dude, the barrels here are amazing. There's so many. Yes, gears. My first bit of gears. That is what I wanted to see. Oh, damn. I need to go back to base already. This little run gave me enough components that when I recycled them, I would have enough for a tier 2 workbench. 
finally crafting bear gear, weapons and deployables. Hey, there we go, we have enough. And we got 1k metal frags as well. Win, win, win. I'll leave that little fellow. In fact... Hey brother! Hey brother! Hello, hello! Dick. The two. Nice, man. I think I'll place it on this wall here. Okay, first call of action with absolutely no hesitation is going to be a garage door. Uh, should we go with the glowing one? Go for this one. I like this one. Do that. Awesome. Just want to close things off a little bit up here. So it doesn't look so open, I suppose. Yeah, why not? Add one there as well. Just It's so pointless, but just symmetry and OCD. It looks much better, okay? <laughs> nice. Okay, boys and girls. Moment of truth. Please. Can this fit in here? Please, please, please. Oh, yo! <laughs> yes! I was just sat there for like five minutes trying to just spam clicking. Oh, let's go. This is the best base ever, man. This is the best base. This is the best base. Just close it off. Oh my god, I'm one happy man right now. This base is coming a long way better than I expected, bro. I'm so happy about this. This is awesome. By the way, this farm here is literally just from the cave. From about three minutes of farming. <laughs> They're low-key kind of OP, man. Okay, I think it's time to craft a SAR. Oh, it's turning night time, I didn't realise. Oh. That's, self that's a salvage ice pick. Wait, hold up. What? Oh, who cares about the salvage ice pick? I will never have to farm stone for the rest of my time playing Rust. What is that? That is insane. Nice. We will put this bed in here as well. There it is. Wow, that was... Oh. <laughs> My guy really thought. <laughs> Alright, let's chuck some of the junk in this box here. Chuck the food under the tier 2. Okay. We are balling. The guy farming his power line and he's about to leave, I think. If I can just get there. No, there he is. No way! Okay, interesting. <laughs> Yo, there's another one. Yes, I got him. <laughs> Here he is. Ooh, nice. I'll take that. Oh man, I saw I getting gears is like one of the most challenging things in this game. <laughs> Just realised I should probably put on some wooden legs or something. Oh, I have pants. Yeah, I'll make some pants. Why not? There he is. I think. Uh, maybe. 
One thing that would make my life much easier would be a forward operating base above land, allowing me to depot scrap and farm runs as well as adding the new CCTV camera to monitor the entrance to my cave. But before I could do all of this, I heard some gunshots coming from the coast. Molotov raid. Um, I just walked past the big base and he could live there, so I'm just going to avoid it, I think. Oh. He has a teammate. I'm going to just run, bro. Okay, that guy didn't chase, but this guy's here. See what he had. Yeah, another amazing run. Um, 500 cloth, I didn't even notice. Yeah, I think I've got all the all the supplies. I'm not going to really put anything in it. I'm just going to put a crossbow and, and a little kit. Just in case I obviously do die and just quickly want to run out. But I think I'm just purely going to use it as a depot. Depot base. And I think I found the perfect spot for a little base, a little fob, just on top of this rock. There we go, perfect. And also, I've put the door facing the cave because later on I might play around with the new CCTV. So if I can get one like in that corner and it looks at the cave entrance, that would be super good. What? Okay. <laughs> I suppose this is the beauty of the fob. Instead of having to go all the way down into my cave, I can literally just chill up here. So, night passes. I feel kind of bad. That guy was just enjoying running through the wilderness, and I've just murdered him. I could have. Uh, I should have picked him up. Oh. 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 Okay. I mean, do I still feel bad? Eh. I'm so glad I checked that box. <laughs> Make another garage door. I'm not really sure where to put it though. Yeah, I guess I'll do a little little run down to the cave. Just a uh, just a little reminder that I still haven't died. Swipe is going insane. I'm gonna put this garage door here. I think should be a good spot. Nice. Perfect. What the? F He's come. Nice try, losers. L players, bro. They just camp fishing village. That's exactly what they've just been doing. That's why I've been hearing so many shots. 
but like tap shot those got oh, okay that's like the most loser way to play in the world Definitely someone here. Yeah, there, were, there is, there is. I knew I saw someone, bro. It's loads. Oh my god, man. Oh. Oh, how's that? Green card, maybe? No. Oh, more gears. Let's go. I don't know where these guys went over here. I think they just dipped. Let's go. Okay, what I think I'll do is I'll make one garage door and I'm going to make the ladder hatch for the exit. Uh, let me just grab the ladder. I'm going to window this off as well for now. Okay, triangle ladder hatch. Boom. I'll place it this way so it acts as an airlock. If it ever comes to me needing that. There we go. Awesome. Sections it off a little bit as well. Cool. Dude, the vibe like with these skulls is just so cool, man. Gives off such a nice light. Looks lovely. Dude, it would be okay if I could hit my shots. What was that? Uh, I think he's trying to live there. He can live there if he wants. I don't really mind. If he's just solo, that's fine. You can keep your stuff, bro. It's all good. What's going on, man? I'm taking this, so I'm leaving. This is just weird. Right now, there seem to be a lot of PvP in my area, so that's what I focused on for a little while. <laughs> Unlucky, bro. That's karma for camping the uh, camping the power lines. Oh sheesh! I'm always lurking. <laughs> I gotta be really careful here. It's just the life of a solo player, man. It's always in the shadows. Really can't let them guys know where I live. I feel like they're the door camping type.
I saw his teammate like a little bit further ahead of him. I need to be careful. Yep, there he is. He only has a bow by the looks of things. I can't hit this guy too. Oh my god, that was embarrassing, bro. Very embarrassing. A pump. I'll take a pump. Okay. Another awesome run. That kill was so embarrassing, bro. What is going- Hold up, hold up. I actually need to just, like... Oh, I need to just gather myself. That was ridiculous. A few embarrassing kills, if I do say so myself. Just a friendly reminder that I still hadn't died yet. Not once. This was slowly becoming one of my favourite solo wipes. Oh wait, this could be the guy and I'll feel bad if it is. Yo, if this is you, I apologise, I'll leave your stuff on your body. I'm keeping the axe though, I I'm sorry, I, I, I am keeping the axe. Yeah, I don't mind keeping this stuff up here. Because they have a little revy kit, yeah, it's all good. It's all good. There we go. I think that's majority of things. Or well, majority of the important things she meddled. I don't think I'll get raided, to be honest. No one really knows where I live. If I'm gonna keep it for real. I think we'll be good. I think we'll be good. Big day tomorrow, so yeah. Get some, let's get some well needed rest. See you tomorrow. Ah. Well, would you look at that? We survived. I began day two by hitting a few trees, a few barrels, and then heading into junkyard. Oh, a skull. Gimme, gimme. That it? I think that's it. Yeah, that's it. Okay. And what happened here? Yes! Yes, gears! There's a lot of new bases around. And I saw one earlier, that one there. What the f- Okay, we got a cheater. No. Oh my god, that was so scary. Got a cheater in the building. Nice cheat, bro. Nice cheat. Yeah, I'm gonna- I'm gonna see if he is cheating. I'm gonna kill in this base, I'm gonna spawn in my fob. Okay, this guy. Let's look at this. This guy, I don't, oh my god. Nice cheat, noob. So my first death of the server was to a cheater, but I don't really count that. In my head, I'm still flawless. It's actually crazy to me that people play the game like that. It's just... It's just so cringe. I don't understand. 
And it's funny because these players actually pay for cheats, which makes it even funnier. <laughs> so sad, man. So sad. This guy was a toxic racist cheater that was roaming around my area, so I couldn't really leave base until he just got banned. Good. Absolute loser, bro. I then began raiding some of the bases around me to try and claim this little plot of land. I think that's wooden as well. We might have to might have to do a few molly raids. Okay, that one's that one's sheet metal door. We'll come back to that later. Pretty sure this one's also wooden. Yeah, it is. Ooh, we're in luck. I need to craft more though. Mollies are actually so loud, man. They're actually so so loud. Okay, tier one. Uh, not bad. Not bad, I'm gonna seal it. Oh! There we go, awesome. Oh my god, he had a green card and gears. Oh my god. Dude, honestly, I don't know what he was doing. He could have... Yeah, he could have put metal doors down, man. Hit the good stuff. Damn, that was awesome. And you know what? I'm going to chuck four satchels on that door there. That sheet metal door. Yeah, I think that's everything. Take a bit of food. Take that as well. And I'll take the box and then I think... I think we're good. Oh, what? Please. Do. What? So they've changed it back now or something. Oh. Door. Okay, so I just wasted a satchel. Because they've changed. Dude. This game is so weird. They've changed back. Okay. Last week it was four satchels and a bean can. Now it's three satchels and a bean can. What? I'm so confused, bro. This was, again, a good raid, though. Dude. Yeah, not bad at all, honestly. I don't need to stone or anything. Yeah, that'll be fine. Look at this SAR's HP, bro. <laughs> I have used this SAR ever since I've crafted it. I have not lost it. <laughs> That's insane. I had managed to get a green key card from one of these raids, meaning I could now run satellite dish. Getting this blue card would also mean I could hunt for CCTV cameras at tier 2 monuments, as I had plans to set one up facing my cave's entrance. Sorry bro. Oh. Oh. The only problem was, I completely forgot to bring the green card, so I had to get lucky. Forgot my green card which is just so rookie man. Oh, unless this scientist has a green card. Please, please, please. Oh my god, no way. <laughs> no way. I think he's a revolver. Two of them. Ooh. 
Awesome. Let's go. Hey, this overall was a crazy run, man. Crazy. <laughs> okay, I think that will be fine. I guess we'll take the Molotovs as well. Yeah, that'll be good. There's no point in upgrading our foundation, right? Because I can't actually get anywhere. Yeah, that'll be fine, I think. Oh yeah, bro. I mean, there's no point in meddling this, but I just have so much, I'm going to do it anyway. I'll take Kazma down to my right. His teammate, I think he was Hazzy baiting. Yeah, he was. What the? Oh, there's three of them. Oh god, this could be my first death, boys and girls. You guys are ass, but there's just so many of them. Fair play though, that's my first death. And I guess it's a numbers game. <laughs> I mean, I guess that'll do. Yeah, sure. Jeez, I didn't realize I had so much. You know what? It's actually really, really nice to have fishing villages of recycler. I never realized that I usually play blue. I just never realized until a couple weeks ago, to be honest. Yes, kids, yes. <laughs> Damn, I would say my invent's pretty good. <laughs> Get me out of here, bro. Yeah, no one's gonna wanna raid that, bro. Armored, 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 armored. Shimo, 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 shimo. <laughs> yeah, chilling. Awesome. I also really wanna set up that new CCTV system. And I wanna put it on my fob outside. Um obviously I'm gonna need like tech trash and stuff here it is yeah camera I need a camera for that I'll learn down to it and that's something we'll work towards there we go I think I have a small battery in here as well yep just need tech trash and some cameras and computer yeah that's cool bro <laughs> we'll put this 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 there we go we'll just put a little kit in there something simple I now heading into airfield to test my luck to see if I could get a CCTV camera from the card run. I think the card run's been done, bro. I don't hear any. I don't hear scientists. Someone's recycling. And I really want to do this card run, but it's not up. Kind of frustrating. What's this guy doing? Dying of I'm dying of radiation. <laughs> oh. Uh, I mean, there's two mill crates. It might give me a camera. I have. I may as well check. tech trash I can't really be too mad it's 
This might be stupid, but I just saw a guy hitting barrels. And I'm greedy for components. Assassination. Oh, gears, okay. Unfortunately, the card run was completed. I would definitely be back for round two. I mean, all in all, it wasn't actually a bad run, considering we couldn't do the card run. We came back with a lot of, go a lot of goodies. <laughs> it sounds so goofy. <laughs> cool. Thompson, I haven't used one of these bad boys in a while, to be fair. It'll be nice to have an automatic gun, I think. This box is... This box here is so juiced, man. <laughs> it's so juiced. There we go. That'll be fine. Oh, there's a boat. Could have been the hazmat, he could have been He could have been baiting. I need to check. Yeah, it was. Oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> Get a solar panel for me as well. Oh. No way, man. Dude, they came in on a boat. I thought they were just Oh my Yeah, that's fine. I don't need anything else. What? <laughs> Lovely. Oh, oh, oh. oh, what? 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 Oh, my goodness, man. No way. <laughs> What's up? Oh, I don't know. Let's just get back into the cave. This actually could be one of my greatest wipes ever. I've died once. Well, screw the cheaters. I've died once. Holy shit. <laughs> what is going on? What is going on? This wipe was absolutely incredible and by far one of my smoothest. A little time had passed, so I decided to head back to Airfield to try my luck once again. Take a spur med? Thank you. Man, what the hell? Holy, that was terrifying, bro. Oh. I can hear them. Yes. Ooh, interesting. Camera, 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 no camera. No cameras. Oh, hopefully it's auto target gives me cameras, bro. Please give me a camera. Yes. Yes. Camera secured. I now needed a computer station, which I could purchase from Outpost. I also took stone to trade for a bit of wood. A whole lot of nothing. <laughs> 300 scrap, let's get a load of stone. Computer station. Thank you. That'll do. Ooh. 
We keep it silence and Loki out here. Um. You know what I'm going to do as well? Wait for it. This is going to be awesome. Oh, yo. Before setting up the CCTV, I noticed a new base that popped up right behind my cave. So I grabbed a few Molotovs and went over to raid it. What furnace is there? I'm going in. You're going in. Yeah, that's definitely too high, I think. What the hell is going on here? What is going on here? Ooh, okay. That is actually sick. This room now has a use, and it is a pretty cool use. I now had the surrounding area all to myself, and I figured it would be a great time to set up this awesome CCTV system. I have the battery over there already. Yeah, that should be that should be it. Yeah, what I was wondering is how are these things placed? So do you have to place them so they're sort of hanging like this? I think you have to. Luckily, I have the perfect idea. Look at this. Um, okay, so now, so if we hop in here, like E1, dude, look at this. No way. <laughs> this is so sick. Yo, this is sick, man. Oh, I love it. I love it. I love it. You guys see my hot bar? Look at all these rugs, man. I have so much cloth. I need to use some. Wait. It's a thing? What the f- How did I not know about that? I made too many rugs. How pretty. But the rugs. <laughs> this is like some like hippie base. <laughs> this is amazing. Oh my god, what was that aim? I gotta wait. Go loot. Go loot. Go. Dude, I can't loot. That's so sad. Oh. someone on his back. Do you have a gun? Oh, sword. 
Two more gears. What a kill. Worth. But while I'm here, I may as well face this garage door on this one. Nice. Before heading off of the server, I wanted to do an Explo Ammo raid. But before doing this, I headed to Airfield to do the run. I saw a horse I wanted right outside an active base, so foolish me decided to try and get it. My game just froze. Oh shit. No, we're dead. We're so dead. So dead. No, oh, my second death of the server, man. Might read this one. I think this this might belong to my little buddy. But I haven't seen anything from him today, and I've been playing for well all day, so. I think maybe he could have quit. I'm gonna see if he has any goodies. I decided to set up a little shop just to see if I could get some extra CCTVs and then I went to raid. My SAR's about to break, I need to try and get in this, but I just saw counters as well, I need to try and get in this base. Nice try, losers. Okay, I'm going out with this broken SAR. If I die, who cares? Oh, I didn't even lose the broken saw. Oh, wait. No, I didn't. Okay, well, it's a low key a dub. That was nice and quick. Oh, he was broke, broke. Oh, he was broke. And this was where I ended my amazing solo journey, completing my goal of creating an incredible cave base whilst also adding some extra cool things that made this base one of my favourites. I really hope you guys enjoyed this video, I appreciate you all so so much. A massive thank you to our channel members, your extra support means a lot to me. I'll see you all next week for another solo rust adventure.